team it's flex how you doing welcome back to the maybelline makeup loft today we are talking sweat proof summer makeup i know how it is when it's hot and sweaty and you still want to look like you put in a lot of effort with your makeup but you don't want to sweat it off within five minutes of leaving the house that's where i come in i've got some tips for you if you want to see how i achieve this look and then just keep watching topic of discussion is sweat proof summer makeup now I'm of the belief it's not what you apply, it's how you apply it. Sometimes you don't need all the products you think you do, you just need a good strategy and to understand why you're applying the things you're applying. Now first I'm going to jump in with the Master Prime Hydrating Primer with Hyaluronic Acid which is great for giving your skin like the appearance of it being smoother. Now next up, concealer. I know what you're thinking, where is the foundation? There will be no foundation. Now the thing with sweat proof makeup is you want to work in really really small layers and build products into your skin. I find that in summer you're already sweating and building you know primer on top of foundation, on top of concealer. It's just a lot of product and you can't guarantee the staying power. So let's focus on how we apply products not how much of it we apply. So concealer, I'm using the Instant Age Rewind in the shade Caramel and that's just going under my eyes. The tip here, as I said before, is to build in small layers. Don't apply a ton of product and work from there. Build, build, build in small layers. Make sure you just push things into your skin. All right, so now that you've got your concealer laid down, you're looking fresh, fabulous. Of course, there are still imperfections and flaws shining through. If there's ever a time to flaunt your face, kind of exactly how it is then summer is it now next i'm going to go in with this two-step process that's going to guarantee that this face will be sweat proof it is the master fix baking and brightening loose powder and then topped up with the master fix setting and perfecting loose powder so these two there First, I'm going to bake. Baking was one of those very popular things about a year or two ago. Essentially, it's applying a yellowy powder to your skin, to your T-zone where you would get oiliest the most, allowing it to sit there, bake, and absorb the oils from your skin. You dust that off, and then you put on your actual face setting powder. So we tackle the T-zone first, and then we move on to the rest of the face. So I'm just going to dip in. Now there definitely was a time where people were afraid of applying powder this thickly to their skin because they're worried about it flashing back white in photos. This one doesn't. So it's photo. This one doesn't flash back. So it's, you know, flash photography friendly. See, the thing about sweat proof makeup is to think about the products that you can put on your skin that won't run down your face at the first sight of perspiration. So next up is blush. I use the Master Blush Color and Highlighting Kit and I mix these two berry tones at the end. And honestly, I find powders are much easier to work with in summer. You can really pack them on and be really considered about where you're applying it. I just find that cream products can get a little bit messy when you start to sweat and all of a sudden you put your blush here but now it's down in your jaw and like... If I still don't look like I've put in some effort, I'll run my I'll run my blush. I'll run my brush that has blush on it over my eyes and just adding a little bit of warmth and gives the illusion that I have, you know, put in some extra effort. Last and most important step is highlighter. You know me, I live by Master Chrome in Molten Gold. It's this beautiful true gold shade that just brings in this like amazing luminosity to your skin. It's really beautiful. And again, using a powder highlight and building it to me is going to be more sweat proof or sweat resistant than using a cream product. And that is my sweat proof summer makeup. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you like what you see, then make sure you subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Okay, see you later. Bye.